We understand that you're the sheriff of these parts. I know that better than anybody. There's been an outbreak of sightings of Bigfoot. Miss Romaine, Mona Lisa, people are going crazy. And I'm here to find out what the truth is. As objective as you can, in your 40 years, tell us what you think about Bigfoot. Son, I, I hate to even have this interview with you about Bigfoot because I'm afraid that it sidetracks me a little bit from all the great uh, things that, that have gone on in the county and my role in law enforcement. Because there have been some strange things that have happened up here in the mountains. Uh, there have been, I can think of, two times at least where people have gotten lost or have hiked up in the Jocassi Gorges, have gone around to different places and never come back. And we've had to look for them. And these two, we never found alive, but we found blood, we found signs of a struggle, and it didn't look like it was struggles with a man. Now maybe it was a bear, but you know, bears really don't attack people up here. There's no record of any bear killing any person. I don't think it was a bear. And, and of course, people attribute that to Bigfoot. There've been numerous sightings, but there've been two reports actually filed with the Sheriff's Office during the time I've been here. One was, was filed by Betty Samuels. She claimed that a Bigfoot actually attacked her and, and sexually uh, molested her out in the woods. Bigfoot sexually molested her? Sexually molested her. All right. We never were able to get to the bottom of that. We never did any DNA testing or anything like that. And of course, you know, I tend to doubt those things anyway. And you know how the, the Powers boys are that live right back there behind her. And, and, uh, and she'd been fairly friendly with them, so I, I just don't know about that, and that's one that's inconclusive. The other one bothers me a lot. It was one about a canoeer that was down on, on the Chattooga River, and they found his body, and I had to go out and look at it, and, and, and they said he'd been attacked by some animal, but that man had not been attacked by any animal that I know about because his, his, his body was torn apart. It was the most vicious killing I ever saw. This, this was just a mean animal that did that. And of course, we did our best to get to the bottom of it, and we never did. But there were two people, two guys that we interviewed that said they saw an animal that they thought of like the one that I saw, just a little ways down the river from when that happened. So I am a believer in Bigfoot. Now, whether we'll ever find it, whether we'll ever have scientific proof or not, I just don't know. But I am the sheriff of these good people, and I'm going to do everything I can to take care of all the, the illegal things that happen here, including the Bigfoot issue. Well, I appreciate you sharing that with us, and we're going to get the article written, and we will figure out the truth. But thank you very much. Thank you, DJ.